welcome to my father-in-law's kitchen. <laughs> we are here for Christmas, so we're about to run out and go to Bush Gardens because Bush Garden video is coming your way. But um, I wanted to make a quick dinner because we're going to be there for like three or four hours, which is enough time for this to cook. Yep. So um, it's a super easy about five ingredient recipe. I have some chicken thighs. I took the skin off. Mine is bone in. You can do it with breast as well. I was trying to be cheaper. And then I have green beans and I cut up two baking potatoes. They were cheaper at Aldi for me. So what I'm going to do, generally you want to separate them. I will do as much as I can. It's not going to be perfect. So I'm going to cut potatoes. And I'll, I'll link a recipe too. This is, I've made it before. Brian loves it. In fact, I'm doing a tutorial because my best friend Katie, I'm going to link her down below, loved it when I made it for her in house. So now I'm going to do some green beans and you know, I'm draining it. You know, she got the potatoes separated on one side there. My chicken will probably end up going on top because I have a small, small crock pot. And I'm actually going to go ahead and give it a pre-season because what's on the bottom isn't going to be seasoned very well. So what seasoning you got there? I am going to use Badia's Complete Seasoning. This, is a, this normally calls for dry Italian dressing, the mix, but you can season it any way that you want. All right then. Yeah, so I'm going to do this. Get it all in those potatoes. I'm going to put the rest of my potatoes down. And I'm going to do something different. Normally, oh, we lost one. <laughs> <laughs> I threw it. Normally, we um, it's all together in a pan. You can also bake it, and I'll put down that recipe as well. I'm going to put the chicken on top. It's a whole lot of chicken. Mm-hmm. And it'll all cook down as long as it can close. Okay, so there it is. Put some more of that. Badia yeah. on there. Yep, and I forgot to get one thing out of the fridge. Extra seasoned. Oh, Look how beautiful yeah. that looks. There we go. And then you can top it with oil, and then you top it with butter. That's one of those freestyles. You can do sweet potatoes with it. Um, I've done it with different types of green beans before. I've never done it with um, fresh. I've already always used canned. I've done frozen before. Okay. And there we go. That's enough butter. Has enough seasoning. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to put on the lid. And then set it for high for four hours. There you go. And we'll see you later. Yep. And this is the completed dish. And we're going to take it all apart and show you what it looks like on the plate. But it's been cooking for about a little over five and a half hours. It looks yummy. Yes, it does. And this is it plated. Doesn't it look delicious? Smells good, too. And just remember, you don't have to use that seasoning. Use whatever seasoning you want to do. It could be ranch. It could be Italian. It could be Old Bay. Um, yep. whatever, <laughs> whatever you choose. But it's super simple and cost effective. Let's dig in. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you enjoyed this cooking tutorial. I will leave the recipe in the description and a link to all of our social media as well. And don't forget to give us a like and comment and hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. But thank you so much for watching. We very much appreciate you. Thanks for watching, y'all.